endocrinology rapid fire cortisol edition. I'm here with renowned endocrinologist, Dr. Ann Peters. She's a full professor of medicine at USC Keck School of Medicine. She has authored over 300 yes. papers and four textbooks. Yes, yes. She is the hormone expert. When you hear the term cortisol fatigue or cortisol overstimulation, what goes through your mind? Nothing. Do you think that this hype now about particularly women over 50 overstimulating their cortisol, air quotes, is valid from an endocrinologic standpoint? No. Hormones are incredibly well regulated and cortisol is one of the most well regulated because without it, you, you die. die. Okay. There is a variation the cortisol levels. Just to be crystal clear, this hype that's going around right now in the wellness industry and field about particularly women overstimulating their cortisol, you would say is crazy. I'm never going to doubt anybody. I'm just going to say it's probably untrue from an endocrinologic biological perspective. Whether it's due to stress, I'll believe it. Changes in hormones, I'll believe it. But it's not a pathologic condition. In menopause, is there a derangement in a woman's cortisol level? No, it may change because sex hormone binding hormone changes. It's not going to be deranged. It is a depressing, difficult time for many women. They gain weight, it's harder. The cortisol levels may change. That's a normal change in their cortisol levels. And we have to fix the whole picture. You don't just fix one thing. That's not the way the body works. Right. When you talk about some wellness behavior like cold plunging for women, stimulating cortisol, would that be necessarily a bad thing? Well, there's no science that it's a good thing, but if you wish to do it, go ahead. The one thing that you think people don't understand about cortisol is? That it's very accessible, meaning we have great tests study whether or not cortisol levels are normal. I want to help everyone have a normal level, but I don't do it just by focusing on cortisol. There you have it.